It's by a candle. This red candle sits in a dull brass holder. Let's take it. A uh, white candle rests in an ornate holder. Let's take it. Uh, you look over the cover of the book, discovering a strange symbol catching the corner. Who knows what the wisdom contained within is. Yeah, I'll take this one. You barely understand the cryptic writings of the words. However, a particular one particular word stands out from pl Placlear. In your mind's eye, you see the glaive growing with power. Write it down in a strange mark in your spell book. You've learned a new spell. So this is the this is the spell book, right? So uh, a calm peace quells the stormy thoughts in your mind as you gaze intently at the symbol. Seems kind of obvious then. Okay, there's a lot to look at in this room. This bookcase is chock full of tomes with every imaginable size and color. This bookcase is littered with shelves with markings and symbols you do not recognize. You fail to find any rhyme or reason to how the books are shelved and uh, books in the shelves are arranged. These shelves appear to be filled with collection of books rather than individual tomes. Whoa! Whoa! Oh God! Whoa! <laughs> Sensing something strange, you step closer to the books in these shelves. A series of shelves are cluttered with books of varying shapes, sizes, and colors. The accumulation of knowledge in this place must be truly staggering. Okay. Oh my goodness. You've gotta be joking. Let's pick one at random. Letters of the spine are dulled and faded, however, you can still read that it says the heart of the steps. You notice that the spine of this book reads Legends by Berwin. Oh my god. Read the title of the spine of this book, Impressions of a Critique. The spine of this book has only one word. Ulorel. Uh, let's open that book. This book comes out a few inches before stopping with a loud click. Okay. Interesting. Let's open this one. Nothing but humorous, humorous in it. The dirty skeleton with the glass eye too big for its head just said, Why, I grind your skin, of course. Oh my god. It's from Kent. Okay. <laughs> it's what? What's it from? You you recognize? It's from, the... it's from a. It's from a uh, a creepy pasta. Aha. Okay. And I'm a nerd for knowing that. All right. It's just <laughs> it's a call out to a creepy pasta. You have to get inside. This is yeah. This is directly bad. Like it's, it's a long it's a long drawn out story. But holy shit! Do all of these open? All right, this book comes out a few inches before stopping with a loud click. You remember reading this story as a boy. The hero is laid waste to a horde array, cleaving head from the body with ease of a veteran campaigner. The Asturian steps lay coated in blood of those who have laid strewn. I must take back the heart of Ordrak, the warrior thought, shouldering the weapon before the yeah, I don't recognize that one. Are all of these individual things? It looks that way. We're gonna be here a minute. Lupin paused before the band of assassins with a pained expression. As the thief, he much better suited to stealth. Fighting comes face to face for the is for the birds. Just when things look darkest, Jeekin jumps in from the window and shouts with a crashing of the ground in a roll, the wooden cudgel at the ready. So, alright, that's from Lupin the Third. What about you? Oh no, we just we just did this one. Oh my god. You're gonna have to go from right to left or something. I don't know, man. I'm not gonna bother looking at but them. I'm just gonna pull them open. We've 
we've had some hold on hold on hold on before we're here all day let's yeah. look at our scrolls there's got to be like we must have come across the hint for this puzzle somewhere along the way maybe yeah it feels like we should have all right um it's just more reading right oh no i don't know what was the name of the other book that had a symbol on it Here we have estimated the ambition of the depths. You would travel in the dark arts. Proceed Protect the seal. seals at all costs. You must not get them. I know it is forbidden to enter each other's demands, but I am for you. To okay, so you read Demain. a scroll. Yeah, I made. I read a scroll accidentally. Wait. Long keep. Have your strength to Olthams. This what? That was this one's name, right? Maybe I'm wrong. If nothing else, prepare the weather master to blunt the evil one's advance, especially in your support. Fare thee well. So, all right. Once again, let me look at this thing. The title of the book is fascinating and intriguing for a large reality by Elder Anaham. It is pulled out from the shelf a bit. An entreaty for a larger reality. Yeah, all but right, it, what's the other? See, that's the thing is. It would be easier just to pull them out. The spine of the book has only one word. Olorula. Well, then I would go I would go from right to left. I guess. Read the famous play now act 1. Now as the centers are con contentment made somber winter by the moon if Thal and sun and, and smile upon our house. The shallows of the sand uncovered now fr free from garlands. Our healthy legs freed from... I don't recognize this one. See, earlier we saw uh, an anime, right? So there was an anime. There's a creepypasta. This has got a whole bunch of shit in it. I wonder if this is where they let backers just add some random stuff they thought was cool. That would be pretty funny, you know. Your manager takes over as you read the story. Commissioned by the first circle of the assembly of Don't the Don't read the story. Just, you know, just magic. But it's fascinating. Some of this is interesting, all right? <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't know. This is ludicrous. We cannot possibly be expected to pull out all of these books. Which is why I was thinking maybe there was a hint in a scroll. There we go. Here's another oh, one. Oh, congrats. <laughs> What's this one called? Uh, Odd Swarming Jetsim by Lilith Air. I don't... No clue there. What on earth is happening here? <laughs> I'm... It's probably going to be you need to pull out some random set of these books. So, so far, all the books that I pulled out that have had something on them have been really thick. Skip the end of this book and started reading... <laughs> like the three of us. <laughs> My oak unbridled <laughs> sea towards the mount have the maiden sins stronger, deeper, for this taller. I don't, I don't know the end of this book. I don't know this book. Uh, how about this one? It's pretty thick. Uh, one more page is nothing human. Oh, this is the skeleton one. Okay. Um. Christ. This one looks pretty thick. Have I done this one? I, I think I have. Yeah, I, 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 this is like the third time I've done this because it's so goddamn conspicuous, right? Why do they do this? Well, this one, I think, is actually from this world. <laughs> oh, okay. I can't open the bookcase, but I can open all these books. 
What does it mean, guys? Should I give up on this right now? Maybe. Yeah. We'll return Let's see if then. there's some more guides to help us. Uh, this is a brimming bookcase. You feel the movement of air coming from someplace behind it. Okay, so this bookcase opens this bookcase. Nice. Seems to be that way. A scholar or two would have given anything for a few of these. At least this book, this library is larger than the than the last one. Go, go yeah. back to that book bookcase and ask York. There's got to be, there's got to be a hint. So many books, so many authors. I swear I've seen some of these name, these names written on them somewhere. That does kind of sound like you just have to check them all. It's not what we wanted to see. Etching of a kitten. A kitten. <laughs> Parrot saw by Throckmorton Fiddling. Uh, Reginald is unhappy with his appearance and blah, 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 blah. Um, exploration of thermatergy. Huh. Yep, there we go. What comes okay. out a few inches? Uh, title of the book sounds fanciful. Great Piper by Della M Minnell. Th these are all the 12, right? That's what's going on? That could be. Uh, Tell the Laughstock. Uh, Drizdil, the founding of Leif Drizdil, but it's no author. Uh, unable to read the title of this book, really? Let's open it. You've given up and have acquired a terrible headache. Okay. Cool beans. Uh, the Buck and the Maiden. House of something or other. Winter's Tale. Uh, Cardus Rhyme. Uh, Song of the Bell Barbie Bose thing. The Grape Upheaval. I think we looked at that one, right? By Fief. Well, it's got a it's got an author, so let's try opening that one. Uh, to illustrate, look to ten cat people. Blah 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 blah. blah. Uh, here's another one, Piaro. Uh, the Rage Wars and blah 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 blah. blah. <laughs> uh, by Gunther. Yeah. Uh, piece by piece prophecy that shall recite the plan of the forest of Toroth. I don't read anything interesting there. Alright. Uh, this book is blank except for the intertwined circles of offset from each other. What? Destitute, dependency, and deliverance. Your head throbs in your mind. Okay, whatever. Ding, 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 ding. Yeah, The Elders. It's an old book. Uh, this one has a name, so let's open this one. Skip the pages, blah, 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 blah. The Shadows of Blight, Land, Dark Age, Gones, yeah. Uh, another one with a name. Start reading. Alvin touched the dead dog. The blue sparks jumped between them. The animal convulsed and began to shudder and then opened its eyes and licked Alvin's face. It's a true story. You couldn't heal the dog of its broken back because it walked. Wait, is this? Is this that Tim Burton movie? Uh, there's another one by Hirschen Miles. It's got a, it's got an author. Bring math. Uh, blah, 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 blah. uh, no. No. Castle of Dane. 
Mordok's Castle of Danger. Well, I've got to read this one anyway. Your eyes jump in a strange fashion and begin reading the pages. Stepping gingerly among the pile of gold, Dirk quietly moved through the terrible beast singe. Oh, this is really... He briefly catches the eye of Princess Daphne, who lies oh my trapped gosh. in a life... Yeah, I know, in a life-sized hourglass guarded by the hulking dragon. Their <laughs> eyes met and Dirk motioned for her to stay silent as he continued towards his faithful encounter. <laughs> Amazing. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Amazing. Uh, the never ending puzzle? God, no. I'm not reading that. <laughs> what if the never ending puzzle tells us how to solve this puzzle? Because this does seem like a never ending puzzle. Jesus. It just feels that way. Blah, 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 blah. I don't care. Uh, Elder. Requiem for the Count of Cagliostro. Okay, that's the one that has Lupin the Third on it. Uh, portent for Immortality. It's got a name. Uh, parable. Blah, 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 blah. Uh, no. Collection of Man Wolf. Uh, reign of something or other. Sailor's Way by another name. Choose my name because the book. Uh, Heart of the Steps, which we saw. Christ. By Brown Tom. We know Brown Tom. But that's not what we got. Jack Cooks the universe form of the concealment. Out of all the quests I've been on, this is one of them. Uh, Modus Parlor, another name book. Fitted leather, and finally, at the Trump, at the fall of the waters, the death shall become. I, I'm starting to really regret coming into the library. <laughs> there we go, I found another one. Oh, God. <laughs> it comes out a few inches before suddenly stopping and clicking. Oh, thank Christ! We're free! <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. So the trick was just pull out random books and hope for the best. Well, this just. So I'm hitting the L button because this game fortunately has hotkeys. And they're just going, look this, look this, look this. <laughs> I'm sure that was entertaining to someone. Oh, we remember this room. Yeah, but not quite. This it way. wasn't quite like this. It looked a little bit less menacing in the other one. It did look less menacing. Is it really a good idea to have this much fire next to that much paper? Um. Hmm. <laughs> Wizards. I mean, nothing about this room looks OSHA compliant. <laughs> hey, and we found another rune. If you were to hazard a guess, oh, yeah. you believe this hidden room might have been the wi wizard's private study. What? Several fire pits are set within the floor. You know, like all studies. Like, well, yeah, you know, the way wizards are. The brass globe has the raised the outline of the feature carved into it, or land features carved into it. The craftsman's ship is uncanny. Let's open it. You search the breadth and width of the globe, but fail to find any way to open it. Um, hand mirror. It's framed with polished silver, carving a flying dragon in the handle. I believe that's another answer. Maybe. Makes sense. Okay. Um, hi! I see you have run afoul of my traps. Still, you have managed to overcome them and make it this far. I shall concede that you are proving most resourceful. You will soon discover your efforts are but in vain. And the instant that the dread apparition dissipates, leaving you cold chill in its wake. 
Yeah, I guess it makes more sense to do that halfway through than right at the start. Hmm. Magic wood? Throw it in the fire. What is it with this chain? Long chain dangles from some mechanism behind the ceiling. I wonder There's... if it opens up this time. I don't know. Chain the ceiling above. Let's use that chain. You pull yourself up, testing the chain and your full weight. After stepping back and forth a few times, you drop back to the stone. So you can... Rubbing the rust from your hand. Let's go, chain. You cannot go there. <clears throat> Somebody want me to jump into the pit? Well, I mean, we've saved. Yeah, all right. Acting on your favorite nursery rhyme, you jump over the pit several times. Aw. <laughs> Do this one, too. All right. <laughs> it just... Look at the log again. You said that log had some etching on it. Oh, uh... Oh, well, there you go. <laughs> so immediately Ooh, fire elemental. Oh, it's a supernatural way. The crack and pop of a fire elemental appears in the room, playfully filling about the fire. Well, alright. Try and cuddle him. He's cuddled. Oh, God. <laughs> okay. I thought... I was like, okay, we're dead. <laughs> It didn't work this time. <laughs> Grasping the silver ore in both your hands, advanced fire elemental. It's a brief struggle I mean, before the artifact successfully It makes pulls. sense, because we need something socket. to do alchemy with. I guess so. The surface of the orb is now radiates with intense heat. Like you do. Um. Huh. Alright, uh, shall we try another room? Yeah, sure. Can't help but notice that there weren't any books to tell us how to get rid of the Banshee. Well, did we check that last bookshelf, or did we just... Yeah, we checked all the bookshelves. Okay. Only only the one bookshelf had, like, the ridiculous... Why would you Detailed do amount of books, yeah. <laughs> That's so mean. Oh! Okay. Shit got eldritch fast. A large bulbous contraption is connected to the ceiling via a series of cocoon tubes. Freaky. For the observational for observational reasons, several rows of tiered seats are arranged around it. What? 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 Oh yeah, they mean how it's shaped like the uh, surgery rooms. Yeah, it's like an operation. All the old hospitals. What's going on with the spiky dog on the floor? It's a good question. That's probably the dog from the previous game. Well, these long dead carcasses can only be described as dog-like creature with a ser serrated set of bones protruding from its back. It looks like it was once very formidable. I sent into the floor of the room a small grate secured secures its cage. Something large and orange lies inside of it. What about this one? You observe a slimy substance glistening in the grate. Huh. Oh another candle. White candle. It's an ornate holder. Take all the shit. So what is this thing? I have no idea. A huge contraption has appeared to be made from a combination of secreted material metals and iron tubing. A faint inner glow and a slow and almost imperceptible pulse makes it look like a beating heart. I was thinking we'd need the cauldron, but maybe this is our alchemy device. Thick cobweb is choked with dust and dirt. What are with these chairs? A seat of chairs are lined up in the tiered platform. You can imagine wizards sitting there watching various experiments. So is this an alchemy lab? Or is this where the battles take place? 
I'm out of my depth here. I'm just, I'm just telling. Yeah, this both is. Of you. It's very different from the Alchemy Lab from the yeah. original. Oh. Oh. Okay. There's, there's this. Opening looks to be cold. Let's open it. You fiddle around with the opening, but you are unable to open it. <laughs> All right. It's an opening. You can't open it. But but it's an opening. <laughs> Hit it. You strike the opening accomplishes nothing. Uh, whew. Maybe it's just like a uh, pouch. I don't know. I don't know. This is... Honestly, this is really bizarre. What? I don't even know what to make of what I'm looking at. It's... It's like... yogg Sathoth In statue form. But being used as an alchemy lab. Or something. Yeah, seems about right. Cricket's carcass comes apart as you move it. On second thought, you decide to leave it where it is. If this... Okay, alright. This is an alchemy room? Use some alchemy. We've got... We've we, got plants. Okay, we got water. We got plants. Uh, let me save... Oh, we don't have water. Hmm. We don't uh, have water. We... Well, I guess we can't fill that bucket up with water because it has the holes. Yeah, there's a hole in the bucket. Also, we still have this key uh, and no idea what it does. Before we go running around, just mm. rub rub some moss on it or something. You attempt to put the fungus in the opening that fa is a failure. The slot is closed and appears to need to power I for the rest of the castle. I am a genius. Well. Oh, yeah? <laughs> I'm getting out of here. Grand Hall regally adorned with a set of doomed s domed ceilings and blue pulsating mass spews electricity. Showers sparks and the goblin at your feet is a testament of your firing prowess. Either that or just dumb luck. It was dumb luck. <laughs> Faux yeah, show. Much. Oh, it's just generally like there it is, punch it. Okay. There's a lot here to burn. Large hall dominated by a stained glass window oh rising the God, heights of the vaulted ceiling. Yeah, this this place is bigger than the uh, first castle. Well, first off, wh what is this? And can I put it in my pack? It's a wrought iron poker. Used to stir fires. I think that's another thing or majig. Uh, we've got a uh, uh, scroll here. Who wants the scroll? I'll go for it. All right, read ahead. You read the hastily written note. Fandril, I have discovered a great weakness in our defenses. Since we have all the mark, it is simply a matter of separating our heads from our shoulders. Then our remains can be used in the hidden approach, and the wards will be engaged, allowing those with the knowledge to travel the castle unopposed. One merely has to be within the walls for this work. It is signed with three squiggly lines. We've seen three squiggly lines. It was, um... It was... Shit, where did we see three squiggly lines? 